The following video is sponsored by InstantMaddenCoins.com. The only place to get Madden Coins instantly on every console and platform is InstantMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back with another Madden 17 Ultimate Team video. And guys, today it is a Saturday, which means we have brand new legends in the game. Today's legends, guys, the greatest receiver of all time. We'll get to him in just a moment. But before that, let's take a look at the other guy who got added in the game today. And that is middle linebacker, New England Patriots. Teddy Bruschi. Now, Teddy Bruschi was one of the fun players to use back in the day in Madden, in my opinion. I always like to play with him. I think this is the first time that he's been in Ultimate Team. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure it is. Either way, this is a really nice card, guys. He has really great balanced attributes kind of across the board. 85 speed. He does have decent block shedding. It's only an 86, so it's not great, but it's decent enough. 84 for zone coverage. That is actually quite good for a middle linebacker. Solid pursuit attribute with a 94. I mean, that's one of the best actually in the game. Uh, and then good tackling. He's kind of more of a run defender, but he does lack a little bit of the block shed, like I said. So it, it's interesting. I'm, I'm kind of interested to see how he ends up playing. I'm interested to see also what he's actually going for right now. Let's see what the cheapest price is. 314000 right now. So that's decent. I mean, it's really not that bad. Um, and then obviously there's the limited use or the limited time ones as well. So, uh, you know, it is what it is. You can you can decide what you think about, uh, you know, if, if you think that the team chemistry is worth twice that. I don't know. Uh, it, you know, it does increase the price of the card by about 85,000 coins, it looks like right now. So, you know, you got to decide what you think about that. Now, the other card, the big one that everybody's excited about, of course, the greatest receiver of all time, at least stats wise. I don't think there's any question uh, that Jerry Rice is definitely up there among the best receivers of all time. And there he is, guys, 95 overall, an absolute beast, guys. The cheapest one that you can get right now is going for a million coins. And then uh, if you're looking for the limited time one, uh, which does have the two times route runner chemistry, that one is 1.15 million. So it's about 115 or 150,000 coins uh, difference. So, you know. It is a pretty substantial upgrade if you want to just get that chemistry. I don't know if it's worth it. You guys kind of got to decide on your own. But let's take a look at the attributes of this Jerry Rice card, guys. 91 speed, 96 catching. I mean, that's really a really nice attribute, of course. You would expect that out of Jerry Rice. One of the best route running attributes in the game with a 95. Great spectacular catch. Great elusiveness. His release is decent enough at an 85. Great jumping. I mean, really everything that you would look for. It, it, there's no question, Jerry Rice is always one of the best legends that you can get in Madden, and it's great that we're getting him this early in the game. I mean, we're, what, four months into the game, and we're already getting Jerry Rice? So that's pretty nice. I, I mean, I'm definitely happy to see that. It'll be interesting to see what happens if they decide to do Ultimate Legends again this year, because I think Jerry Rice will probably be in that as well. But definitely one of the best cards right now. Like I said, a million coins right now to get your hands on that thing on the PlayStation 4. And we're going to try and pull it right now, guys. Um... I do have some packs that I can open up today, and we've got to try and pull it, you know? We've definitely got to try and pull it. So I'm going to go ahead and pull all of these packs that I have, aside from the quick sells, of course. So that's going to give us 15 total packs, ending with the Legend Pack. We're going to hold that till the end. They do also have Legend Packs that you can get. I think there are 70,000 coins, if I remember correctly. Let me just double check here. Um, they're, they're a pretty decent price, though. I mean, all things... No, they're 90,000, excuse me. For a chance at getting the the Jerry Rice and the and the Teddy Bruschi, so you know it's it's kind of up to you on what you what you want to do regarding that. But like I said, guys, we are going to go ahead and we're going to open up a bunch of these packs that I have. Should be 15 total packs. We're going to go ahead and start off with the pro packs. We've got 10 of those, and uh, we'll see if we get anything decent out of this. So let's go, man. Come on, we just need to get some elites rolling in, baby. Gonna start it off slow there with a Kenny Britt. We're gonna rip through these things pretty quick, guys, because the pro packs are usually pretty trash. And uh, let's see if we get anything. Nope, but Chris Ivory. That's all right. TJ Graham there at the end. Uh, the luck hasn't quite been there this year in terms of packs for me, but we do get a flashback collectible, D'Angelo Williams. I'm pretty sure this is probably one of the cheapest ones that you can get right now. It's nice to get a little bit of an elite uh, start there. Maybe we'll get something more elite here going forward. Andrew Levitre in that pack though for our gold player come on guys let's go we just need that one jerry rice pull dude just one time that would be freaking amazing come on and we're gonna end it with a will beady so nothing in that pack either 
Pro Pack's not the move right now, guys. Definitely not the move as we get a Tyrod Taylor there. That's pretty much going to wrap up that pack. Continuing on here, we got still like, what, four or five of these left. And then we'll move on to the stuff that gives us a little bit of a better opportunity because there are more gold slots. George Iloka there. He's a nice big safety, but his attributes just aren't there enough to actually play on your ultimate team right now. So we do get a Mar Marcus Mariota there, an alternate chemistry one, but still not worth a whole lot. Do get a Jaguars throwback jersey as well. Those are tend to go for a little bit of coins, but not really enough uh, to make me too excited. Let's continue on here. How many more pro packs? We still got a couple left, it looks like. And we got a Tyvon Branch. Nothing out of that pack either. So we really haven't pulled anything yet out of the pro packs. Still holding on, still waiting, still hoping that we can get something decent in this pack opening video as we get a Jason McCourty there. Looks like we might get in, be getting down here to the end of the pro packs. And yes, we are. So next we'll have the all pro packs to rip through. Come on. One time, guys. One time. And here it is, our final card, Justin Pugh. So nothing in that one. All right, moving on to the all pro packs, guys. Still got a few of these to open. I think four of them total. Come on. Ugh. And we get a William Gay. That's at least a team of the week. That's at least got some sort of value to it. All right. I don't know why it's making us go to the quick sells next. We'll go back here to the all pros. Come on. Let's go, baby. Let's get something. Let's get a Jerry Rice, please. Do get a Brandon Cooks there. He's one of the fastest receivers in the game. So that at least has a little bit of value. And nothing else out of that pack. Come on, man. Just one time. It would be amazing to pull something good. Come on. Teddy Bruschi even. Please. I would be so happy with even that. Just one freaking limited time legend pull for just at all in this game. Do get a Mutt Gear there. Still just not anything of real value here, guys, unfortunately. All right. Last all pro pack, I think. Pretty sure this is the last one. Yeah, it is. All right. Next one will be our legend pack. So maybe we'll get some good luck out of this, of it as it being our uh, final all pro pack. And nope. Nate Soldier. Damn, man. All right, guys. We're down to our legend pack. I don't know. We haven't really pulled anything great so far. We have one elite, and it was a freaking flashback collectible. So that's really not that great. But we've got this legend pack. Let's try and make it happen here. Leonard Williams. Come on, just one freaking time, dude. Matt, Jack Muhart, who's having a great season this year. Come on, Vontae's perfect. Michael Orr, this is an elite. And it's a freaking Ed McCaffrey collectible. You got to be kidding me, man. Damn it, that is such a freaking tease. Unreal. Ah, CJ Ozamoa. Joe Flacco, another elite. Could this be it? Oh, it's a Kevin Mawai collectible. You gotta troll me like that with two freaking collectibles. Are you serious, EA? Oh, no. Come on. Jeremy Shockey, legend item. And our final one is another elite. It is a Novaro Bowman base elite. All right, so we get three elites out of this pack. And we get ourselves a Jeremy Shockey gold player. So at least we ended it with some little bit of uh, heart jumpingness in my heart anyway. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please do me a favor and drop a like on it, guys. Let me know in the comments section below if you think Jerry Rice is the best receiver in the game right now. Would you rather have like a Herman Moore? Would you rather have Randy Moss? Who would you rather have as the top receiver in the game right now? Let me know in the comments section below, guys. Thanks so much. Hope you enjoyed it. Drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll talk to you guys again soon.